Evening. Best string in his chili chum. Say hello, Indy. Hi, guys. Right. We have... Ding, ding, ding. The Callard Reaper. Right. Uh, just about to see the little tail in the middle there. Really it happy. is a particularly gnarly, nasty, horrible looking pod. And he's going to be eating it. It's not very big. Yeah. It's only a tiny little pod. I'm dead very disappointed. Well, there were two pods with um, the order I placed with Devon Chili Man. Mm. Um, the other one's gone a bit soft, so I've put that one in the freezer. Uh, to use at a later date, so we'll use this one tonight. There'll be another um, one of these coming out sooner or later. Yeah, we're going to test uh, a similar Carolina Reaper. But from a different project. Different, one different person. Different supplier, yeah, the Yorkshire um, Chili Company. Because what chili company is this one? This is the Devon Chili Man. Ooh. So, what we're going to do is cut we're going to cut it open. And then my dad's eating this and he is scared and I'm happy. Well, we'll see how hot it is. <laughs> so, but it's only a tiny pod. Yes, it is. But ooh. it is all placenta and oil and crikey. Yuck, yuck. I hate that. Well, you can just about pick out the, uh, the oil on the camera. I hate it inside. That looks so creepy. It does. Wow, that's... Smells sweet. Smells chin ends. I can just smell heat, that's all. Yeah. That's, that's I hate all. that side though, Dad. It looks so yeah. creepy with the line. Well, there's a lot of placenta in there, and Ooh. there's a lot of oil, and I think it's going to be hot. I'm hoping. So. Because I'm, I'm. Tell you what, I'll you be, can try that little bit no, there. I'm not putting my finger on anything like that. So it hot? It's warm. Ooh. You shouldn't have done that, Dad. It's got a sweet taste to it. Ooh. Fruity. Yeah, but it's going to be even worse when you have the whole thing. Dad. Yeah. So, right, let's have a little talk I'll about it what it is, okay? It's um, across by uh, the Pucker Butt Seat. Uh, Pepper Company. Is it also in the States? Is it also crossed by a a um, well, scorpion? No, it's got nothing to do with a scorpion. Apparently, it's a cross between a ghost and a habanero. Um, yes. Whether you believe that or not, I don't know. Whether you buy into the controversy around the the pepper, that's up to you. But um, just we're just going to try it. Don't look up the internet; it's not always correct. That's it. Here's a fact. So average on these is about 1.6 million, uh, topping out at about 2.2. Given that it's only a small pod, it's, I'm hoping it's not going to cripple me. Imagine if it's so hot. We'll see. The bigger the pod, the weaker. So five, four, three, two, one, go. Eat your chili. Off the bat, good. Hot. So he, he likes the heat. Oh, yeah. I'll take off your glasses already, Dad. Can I see any mint taste? Have you yet? No. Not yet. Oh, yeah. Is that the taste or the heat? Bit of both. Ooh. Did you like the taste or did you hate the taste? Not a huge fan of the taste. It's quite perfumey. It's Oh, so like the yellow not one, wasn't No, it's not as sweet and fruity as I was hoping. Yeah, I thought it would be better with that nice thing. It is hot. Said. It's very hot. Ooh. I think you got 2.2 2 million point two. I don't nothing. think so. I think it's... It's... It's a very hot bod. Is it the same as the yellow pod we tried? If no. uh, has anybody tried it yet? Because what did you rate that out for 16, wasn't it? I rated the yellow bootloo at 12, and this one, I think... A 10? Is about an 11. Oh! It's so very hot. It's Real strong chin ends taste. Um, it's... 
reminds me a little bit of a habanero of that sort of flavour um, the heat back of the mouth top of the throat yeah well, got a seed or a bit of flesh stuck in the back of my mouth oh bad we can get some water on that dad for you no no not water can you get it out that's better um so, did you rate that out of heat <sighs> of 11 yeah. taste. heat 11 taste 2 out of 10 <laughs> I'm not a fan of the habanero taste. I'm not a fan of that real strong chinense mm, perfume type flavour. Um, heat's still building. I don't like the burn. Burns right at the back of the mouth. Ooh, right bad. by the tonsils. Ooh. It's in one little spot just here. So if you look on my side, turn your head a second, Dad. So basically yeah. about yeah. just there. That's it. Um, I'm, I'm so glad this isn't... I'm so glad I didn't do it. I'm so glad right now. Yeah, there you go, it's peaked. Ah, good. Um, I think. Um, yeah, so not a huge fan of the flavour. Heat, as I said, very good. Uh, 11 out of 10 for heat. Um, the, alter the other name for this particular chilli is the HP22B um, and uh, there's apparently a lot of similarities between this and the Primo uh, created by Troy Primo and what I'm hoping to do is, is get hold of some Primos at one point and, um, and also and compare them with this Dad, I thought because you said a um, a ghost chilli, I thought it was going to be the taste like you always said. No, I like ghost chillies. Yeah, he does. I've got one here that I was going to snack on. Um, Could you eat it now and show us? No. Why? No, because I want to get the, the full effect of this one. But if you see, I'll put it here. This is about a amazing size. I it's love it. It's a good chili. size. Yeah. Um, eyes are watering. A mm. mm, little bit clammy. Uh, right. Burns starting to go. Starting to feel it here. Well, Goes around down into my stomach. It's because you swall swallowed it and all the juice fell yeah. down with it. Yeah. I wonder how you're going to feel when you go to the toilet. I'll be fine. Right. I'm um, very disappointed with this chilli. Are you? Well, it is burning. Um, and I'm just starting to get a bit of a tingle, a bit of an endorphin rush. When we're doing the brown one, you know, if that's going to be all on the yellow one, um, the yellow one's all in there. Well, I think that's going to go down to the fourth place. Okay, well we'll see. We'll talk about other pods when we get there. Um, heat's starting to go. I don't know how long it's going to last for, but... Um, Hopefully it doesn't last long because you don't like it. Yeah. So... We'll call it a night there, and uh, thank you very much. Bye-bye.